This is the main mat room. Uh, come in the main mat room, if you see all these photos, all of my friends, all of my teachers, instructors, um, we have a history uh, going back until 1974. My uh, instructor, Kalkoi Kanyeti, uh, Mr. Inasano and I, this picture here, um, it's not in existence. They had vandals that came into the uh, graveyard uh, or the cemetery in, in Seattle and the vandals tore up Bruce Lee's stone and majority of the monuments at that graveyard. This is our first picture Mr. Anasano and I took in 1974 for Inside Kung Fu magazine. All my instructors that um, I had studied with, most, most of my Filipino arts. Okay, this is um, Albert M. Pran, no longer uh, living, he passed away about five years ago. Of course, you know Wally J. My, my godchild, um, Diana Inosanto. Okay, go on this side. This photos of plaques is all the arts that we teach. The Muay Thai and the boxing, of course, Bruce Lee's Jeet Kune Do. Um, Kao Koi Dosipavis and Jiu Jitsu, Judo and Wrestling. We teach those four arts here. This is um, the original oil painting of Bruce Lee's uh, uh, photo that uh, is very popular throughout the world now. We have this here at the IMB. And if you notice, uh, there's a hole up in the picture because of the, the stick flew out of some person, uh, student's hand and it hit the picture. Okay. Follow me on this side. This is one of two original uh, iron machine that, uh, that Herb Jackson made for Bruce Lee. This is the Lapsau Arm Punch, or the BOG. This is a picking machine here. And we practice our inch punch here. Um, this was going to be thrown away also. It was all in pieces. Bruce Shinigawa put it together, cleaned it up, weld some pieces, and then it's uh, uh, here today. The or other original one, Mr. Inosano have. Okay, follow me this way. We practice little Wing Chun. Uh, wooden uh, dummy. This is my teacher, Tafoy Kanyeti. The only 12 uh, degree black belt in existence. Everywhere I go, for instance, uh, like uh, Rodolfo Alvarez, they make plaques uh, or banners for me. And this is uh, in Acapulco, and I studied with uh, Rodolfo Alvarez in Acapulco since uh, 19, 1984, before the big earthquake. Those pictures up there are all the Filipino warriors and heroes. Of course, uh, Bella Brill is one of the last uh, Eskrima tournament fighter in, in Hawaii. In 1947, they banned it because uh, it was too brutal. And all these other photos in the bottom of the fathers of uh, the Philippine Islands, uh, Rizal, and up there is uh, um, Chief Lapu-Lapu. Most of our schools, New York IMB Academy, uh, fight team. Uh, we have a lot of these um, uh, posters throughout the world. <clears throat> this picture you probably will never see again. This is the six brothers, Kanyeti brothers. Kakoi being the oldest, Elijah Kanyeti, or Moi Moi was the oldest. Okay, come on this side. This was drawn for me by Lewis Grady uh, up in uh, Charlotte, North Carolina. This is the last picture of the family that took at the airport two months before Bruce Lee passed away. James Lee holding a two inch board with fingertips and Bruce Lee would sidekick it with a snap and break it. Linda Cadwell and uh, Shannon Lee. This went for auction for almost $3,000. Bruce Lee's original uh, business card is white one, Mr. Inosano and I. 
And this here was um, Bruce Lee's definite chief aim, where he says that, and he wrote this in 1969, that um, he said that in 1970, he would achieve world fame and will have $10 million, and he will live the way he please and achieve inner harmony and happiness. And in return, he'll give the best quality and capacity of an actor and a martial artist. This is no longer in existence. It was a, a damage with the, by the vandals uh, in the, at the graveyard site. I went to Bogota two years ago, and um, this was Ricardo Vargas, and he made this uh, poster for me uh, because he's spreading the art uh, in um, Bogota, Colombia. Okay, let's go in the weight room.